Hello and welcome back. This is a video on how to create promotional codes inside your Magento store. Uh, once you've logged into your dashboard, all you got to do is scroll over to Promotions, select Shopping Cart Price Rules. Once you've clicked on that, you'll be taken to this page you see now. You can see I already have one in here called Summer 20. I'm going to add a new pricing rule. This one is going to be called the fall discount. Don't have to put a description. It's going to be active. Uh, I want to do it for not logged in pe people that are not logged in. I want to do it for for general. I want to do it for uh, retail. So uh, once we've got that set, you can control click these so you can control so you can select multiple uh, coupon specific coupon coupon code we're going to call it um, fall 15 we can set the number of uses you want per coupon so you can say 100 500 50 10 you can say uses per customer so you can say one customer can only use this coupon one time, five times, ten times, etc. Uh, we're going to do a from, you can set a from date, the date that you want it to start, and the date that you want it to end. And then you set the priority level if you would like to do that. Uh, in the public RSS feed, we're going to say no. Once you've done that, we're going to go to conditions. Conditions would be if you want to apply a condition that uh, the person that adds it to their cart has to spend a minimum amount of $500 or something like that. So you can set those kind of conditions here if you want to apply condition rules. We're not going to go into that right here. We're just going to do a simple coupon. Um, actions. Apply is going to be percent of, of product price discount. You can do a fixed amount discount. So you can say it's going to be $10 off, $20 off, you can do a fixed amount for the entire cart. So that's like saying um, if they spend, you can set a condition rule that if they spend $500, you can do a fixed amount discount of $50 from the entire cart. You can do if they buy one product, they get another product at no charge. So buy X, get Y free, that kind of thing. Um, but for this one, we're just going to do percent of product. As we did uh, fall 15, we're going to set the discount to 15. That's going to be percent. Maximum quantity discount is applied to. Don't need to worry about that. Discount quantity by X. I don't need to worry about that. Apply to shipping amount. No. These are all if it was related to a price. So if you're going to be saying that um, if they did X with this rule, they spent this much, then you can apply, uh, you can count the amount of sh that they're paying for shipping. And here you can give them. Uh, we can count them uh, related to free shipping. No, we can say no, you don't get the discount if you're doing free shipping. We're going to say um, for shipment with matching items, for matching items only. <coughs> we'll say for matching items only. And then labels is all applied to the cart itself. So it's all of the shopping cart here. So rule information is there. So we have the discount. You have the selections, you have a specific coupon, you have the coupon code you want to call it. You can do the, like I said, you can do the number of everything here. Once you've completed that, you click save. <coughs> now, as you can see, we have a summer discount and a fall discount. I didn't apply any kind of start and end date to this. Uh, then we're going to go to the shopping cart where I've got a product here. I've applied the summer 20 and you can see the discounted 7780 for 20% off at 311 which is from this coupon so that's pretty much it that's how to uh, set a coupon rule and apply and add coupons to your cart whether it's based on a dollar off or a percentage off